Skane, a picturesque region in southern Sweden, is known for its rolling hills, lush forests, and vibrant biodiversity. This area is a haven for nature lovers and a sanctuary for a wide variety of flora and fauna. The region's natural beauty and ecological richness make it a vital part of Sweden's environmental heritage. This ecological haven, however, faces a new threat, the invasive flatworm Obama Nungara. Invasive species like this one can cause significant harm to local ecosystems, often outcompeting native species and altering habitats in ways that can be difficult to reverse. This small, unassuming creature, native to South America, has made its way to Swedish shores, raising concerns among scientists and conservationists. Despite its modest size, the flatworm's presence is alarming due to its potential to spread rapidly and its voracious appetite for native invertebrates. Its arrival in Skana underscores the growing global issue of invasive species and their potential to disrupt delicate ecosystems. Invasive species are a leading cause of biodiversity loss worldwide and their impact can be devastating, leading to the decline or extinction of native species. The presence of Obama Nungara in Skana is particularly concerning due to its potential impact on soil ecology. Healthy soil is the foundation of a thriving ecosystem, supporting plant growth and providing habitat for countless organisms. As a predator of earthworms and other soil-dwelling invertebrates, this flatworm can disrupt the intricate food webs that underpin the health of our ecosystems. Earthworms play a crucial role in aerating the soil and facilitating nutrient cycling, and their decline could have far-reaching consequences. The consequences of its spread could be significant, affecting plant growth, nutrient cycling, and the overall balance of nature in the region. Plants rely on healthy soil to access the nutrients they need to grow, and any disruption to this process can lead to reduced plant health and productivity. Understanding the potential threat posed by Obama Nungara is crucial for implementing effective mitigation strategies. Scientists and conservationists are working tirelessly to study the flatworm's behavior and develop methods to control its spread, ensuring the protection of Skana's precious ecosystems for future generations. The story of Obama Nungara's arrival in Skana begins not in the depths of a forest, but in the heart of Malmo, a bustling urban environment where nature and city life intertwine in unexpected ways. Sweden's third largest city, Malmo is known for its innovative urban planning and green spaces. During a routine inspection of an urban planting area, a vigilant gardener noticed something unusual. Among the carefully cultivated plants and flowers, the gardener's trained eye caught sight of something out of the ordinary. A small, flat, leaf-shaped creature was moving slowly across the soil. Its peculiar appearance, unlike any native species, immediately raised suspicion. The gardener, aware of the potential implications, decided to take a closer look. Further investigation by experts confirmed the gardener's suspicions. The creature was indeed Obama Nungara, an invasive flatworm known for its voracious appetite and ability to outcompete native species. This urban discovery was a stark reminder that invasive species can establish themselves in even the most unexpected places, disrupting local ecosystems. It also highlighted the importance of vigilance and the role of citizen scientists in early detection efforts. The involvement of the community in monitoring and reporting unusual sightings is crucial in managing invasive species. The gardener's keen eye and quick action may prove crucial in preventing the further spread of this invasive flatworm. By acting swiftly, the gardener not only protected the local flora, but also set an example for others in the community. This incident underscores the need for ongoing education and awareness about invasive species and their potential impact on urban environments. Obama Nungara poses a significant threat to the delicate balance of Skana's ecosystems. This invasive flatworm, originally from South America, has found its way into European soil, where it has no natural predators to keep its population in check. Its primary prey consists of earthworms, which play a vital role in maintaining soil health. Earthworms are often referred to as the engineers of the soil because of their crucial functions. Earthworms are essential for nutrient cycling, soil aeration, and decomposition processes, all of which contribute to the overall productivity and biodiversity of an ecosystem. They break down organic matter, turning it into rich, fertile soil that supports plant life. As Obama Nungara spreads and its population increases, it could decimate earthworm populations, leading to a cascade of negative effects. 
The loss of these vital organisms can disrupt the entire soil ecosystem. Reduced earthworm activity can result in soil compaction, decreased water infiltration, and impaired nutrient availability to plants. Compacted soil is less able to support plant roots, leading to weaker and less resilient vegetation. These changes can have far-reaching consequences for plant growth, impacting both natural ecosystems and agricultural lands. Farmers may see reduced crop yields, and natural habitats may struggle to support their native plant species. Furthermore, the decline of earthworms can disrupt the food chain, affecting animals that rely on them as a food source. Birds, small mammals, and other creatures that depend on earthworms for nutrition may find it increasingly difficult to survive, leading to a ripple effect throughout the ecosystem. In the battle against invasive species, early detection is paramount. The sooner an invasion is identified, the greater the chances of successful eradication or containment. Once an invasive species becomes established, its population can explode, making control extremely challenging and costly. Early detection relies heavily on public awareness and participation. Citizens play a crucial role in acting as the eyes and ears on the ground, reporting any unusual sightings of plants or animals that could be invasive. By familiarizing ourselves with the appearance and behavior of Obama Nungara, we can all contribute to its early detection and help protect Skene's biodiversity. The discovery of Obama Nungara in Malmo highlights the power of citizen science. The gardener who first spotted this invasive flatworm may not have been a trained scientist, but their observation and subsequent reporting were crucial in raising the alarm. This example underscores the vital role that everyday citizens can play in tackling environmental challenges. Citizen science initiatives empower individuals to contribute to scientific research and conservation efforts. By engaging with these projects, Citizens can gain a deeper understanding of their local environment, learn to identify invasive species, and contribute valuable data that can inform management strategies. Citizen science not only helps address pressing environmental issues, but also fosters a sense of community ownership and responsibility for protecting our natural heritage. Section 6. Reporting Your Role Matters If you believe you have encountered Obama Nungara, it is essential to report your sighting to the relevant authorities immediately. Your report, no matter how small or insignificant it may seem, can make a significant difference in the fight against this invasive species. Timely reporting allows experts to assess the situation, track the spread of the flatworm, and implement appropriate control measures. To report a sighting, take clear photographs of the flatworm, noting its location and any other relevant details. Contact the Swedish Environmental Protection Agency or your local municipality to report your findings. Your actions can contribute to the protection of Skana's biodiversity and the preservation of our natural heritage. Section 7. Spreading the word, not the worm. Raising awareness about the presence of Obama Nungara and the threat it poses is crucial in preventing its further spread. Share information about this invasive flatworm with your friends, family, neighbors, and social networks. Encourage them to learn how to identify it and report any sightings. By spreading awareness, we can create a network of informed individuals who can help monitor and control the spread of this invasive species. Education and community engagement are essential tools in the fight against invasive species. Together, we can make a difference in protecting Skane's ecosystems. Section 8 safeguarding Skane's biodiversity. The arrival of Obama Nungara in Skana serves as a stark reminder of the interconnectedness of our world and the potential consequences of human activities. In an era of globalization and climate change, the introduction of invasive species is a growing threat to biodiversity worldwide. Protecting Skane's biodiversity requires a multifaceted approach, including prevention, early detection, rapid response, and long-term management. This effort requires collaboration among government agencies, scientists, conservation organizations, and most importantly, the public. By working together, we can mitigate the impacts of invasive species and preserve the ecological integrity of Skana for generations to come. Section 9. Conclusion, A Call to Action The discovery of Obama Nungara in Skana is a call to action for all of us. This invasive flatworm, though small and unassuming, has the potential to disrupt the delicate balance of our ecosystems. 
its presence underscores the importance of vigilance, early detection, and community involvement in protecting our natural heritage. Each one of us has a role to play in preventing the spread of invasive species. By educating ourselves, reporting sightings, and spreading awareness, we can contribute to the collective effort to safeguard Skan's biodiversity. Let us act now to protect the natural beauty and ecological integrity of this remarkable region for generations to come. Together, we can make a difference. Like a